Hey guys, I'm here with Lindsay L at Sim C Rocks 2022. It's a vibe. The walls are shaking, <laughs> you guys. The walls are shaking. <laughs> and so, what wasn't shaking, but kind of was, Lindsay actually played the Country Outdoors concert series in 2020. Yeah. When everything was shut down, and really there was only a couple things going on in Nashville. Um, and so it's nice to be able to see you on the opposite side of that where things Thank are pumping you. back up. We're now out here, you've just been nominated for a CMA, so things yeah. are really heating up. How's life been post P word? Yeah, exactly. Girl, things have been so good. Thank you so much for having that series. I think, you know, series like that brought us through the pandemic yeah. and I was just so grateful to have opportunities to still be able to see you guys and to give you music and to and to receive you know all of your love it was just amazing and um i i'm so happy to be back at cmc you know i was i was here in 2019 which feels like yesterday honestly but it just feels so great to be back and to be here the fans are ready there's such an amazing energy out there and uh we cannot wait to hit the stage and so what do you think is like is do you see any differences between australian country music fans and american country music fans yeah, I, I, I love that they're so passionate. Like, both Australian and American country fans are so passionate. But I will say, there's something about Australian country music fans that I do not see anywhere else in the world. Like, you come to CMC and you know that everybody is, like, ready to rock. They're, like, ready to go in. And I will say that <laughs> we play a lot of festivals in North America and around the world. And, you know, when you're first on main stage, for instance, there's, like, a handful of people there. But not at CMC Rocks. At CMC Rocks. You are playing to a full festival grounds. Like everybody comes early and makes every artist and musician feel so loved. They're there to get their spot for the whole entire day. And it's just, it's one of the best festivals. It's like a truly a, a little slice of heaven out there. And now that you're an alum, like you've earned your teeth here, the Aussies I'm sure are following you like nobody else. But even if you're a very new artist here in Australia, if they see that you're on the bill, they will download your album and learn it every word. Yeah, Aussie country music fans are definitely like awesome when it comes to that kind of thing. So I know as well that you love the outdoors, you love hiking and all that good stuff. Are you planning to do any of that while you're here in Australia or is it a quick flight back? Oh my gosh, every single day I have been like walking around the cities. I've been like eating whatever food I can. I really wish I could get out to like the mountains or the beach, but pretty much it's like work, 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 work. But I have been walking every time I'm not on stage, I'm like walking around the cities and campgrounds. And I just, I love, love Australia. Okay, awesome. And so what can people expect from your performance here? Um, Just a really good time. Lots of crazy guitar solos. I remember my oh, performance. Oh, that doesn't sound like a Lindsay uh, performance. <laughs> I remember my performance in 2019. I walked on that stage and I just like turned into a different human being. There's like something about the energy of CMC. Yeah. I was like jumping on top of monitor speakers and laying down on the floor and playing. And that was the first time I'd really ever done those things. And so CMC just brought this like thing out of me. So who knows? Like, what's a, Drake, like a Drake White, like kind of, or yeah. Just like <laughs> you like unleash the beast, so to speak. Well, I love it. My last question is. You know, we've come out the other end of a couple crazy years. You've got an amazing year ahead of you. What You've got nominations ahead of you. What kind of advice would you give to artists that are looking to follow in your career now? You've been through a lot. You've been here for a long time. And also, what do you want to be remembered for? Goodness gracious. Um, great questions. I... I really hope that when people listen to my music that they can just feel that it's authentic and it's me. And, um, and honestly, I think that as as anybody with a platform or anybody without a platform, I, I think that our job and responsibility as, as humans is to use our platform for good and to talk about things that we care about and, and that we're passionate about. And I hope that I I can I can do that through my music and people can hear that through my music as, yeah. as um, I think that that's the responsibility of just being a good person on this planet, you know? Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. Well, I can't wait to watch your performance as well and we'll we're catch so up on the other side of the, World back in Nashville, guys. Lindsay L. here at CMC Rocks 2022.